Hey YouTube, I ho hope you guys are doing well out there. I um, want to make a quick video on something that kind of got me got me thinking here. Um, again, um, I've been doing some uh, searching on Craigslist today and other sites, um, but on Craigslist, for example, I've seen something that I had ne had never seen before. It's uh, some uh, local coin uh, dealer or bullion dealer selling monster boxes promoting the sale of monster boxes of Canadian maple leaves and American silver eagles and their their advertisement uh, they're about three hour drive for me but they're promoting these these maples monster boxes and they're uh, offering pretty good prices I didn't call them because it's, it's kinda late but uh, seems like they're aggressively doing a campaign to sell them uh, also, uh, somebody else is selling uh, 300 face half dollar Kennedys, uh, $300 of face value for $5,300, which is about 1766 face. Now, having said that, there's other campaigns going on by Atmex. They have some sales, uh, their summer carnival sale, which is 15 through the 15th and 9th, uh, finishes on the 19th of this month, and um, Gainesville. Gainesville came out with their Wardbird coin. Um, not, I don't know that much about it, but I know that that's the guy, Chris Wayne, Dwayne or whatever, and they're selling that Wardbird to, <clears throat> excuse me, 299 over spot, and then right below that, they're selling their uh, Silver Buffalo Rounds, for 99 over spot. Now silver is silver when you're talking about rounds and I don't know why anybody would pay 299 for the Wardbird coin uh, which is a round. It's not government issued. I would buy the, the silver buffaloes for 99 cents. I mean two dollars is, uh, is, is a big difference here in premium. Now what I'm seeing here, and also AppMix is, uh, oh, I already mentioned AppMix. Silver Doctors is a website that I go to once in a while, and they, they're big on gloom and doom and, and everything else, but there's plenty of supply out there. And all these places are having these sales. Uh, and Silver Doctors, it says right there, you know, above, below all their stories of uh, Bernanke and, and, sil and gold going up and silver's shorted and this and that, and and they're lo they're lowering their prices and silver's on sale. It looks like there's plenty of supply out there. So what I'm trying to say here, I'm going to go out on a limb. I think we're in for a smash down here in the next week or two. I'm thinking below 17 or right around 17 is where silver's going next. Um, and I'm you know for me I'm upside down because I did some purchases in November. Uh, and December and a little bit in January but now like these coins here that I have here in these tubes these are all um, like I'll buy a panda when I place an order um, with Provident and some of these were bought through AppMix back in uh, I have some of the wildlife series here and some kookaburras so these are all 30 plus dollar coins so I'm thinking here I'm gonna wait a week or two and I have a gut feeling, again, I'm not telling anybody what to do or giving anybody advice, but I'm thinking $17 or below silver. Those are my thoughts um, because I see all these sales and I see all these promotions. And the, the Monster Box one is something I have never seen before where they're aggressively uh, pushing Monster Boxes of Canadians and, and American Eagles. And you have to buy a minimum. There's no breaking the box. So... It seems like they have plenty of them. Um, so just food for thought is that uh, I think prices are going lower. And uh, I think it's going to be a great time to buy here. It's going to be an interesting week this week. All right. I hope you guys are having a great night. And uh, thanks for watching. I appreciate all the feedback. And let me know what your thoughts are on the pricing. Um, I know a lot of people want silver to go up. And so do I. But right now, I have no problem with it going lower. Uh, 
so I can buy some more and bring my dollar cost average down is what I'm working on. Again, this is for someone that's in the long term. So I uh, hope you all are doing well. Keep stacking and uh, have a great night.